What's up guys, it's Kanan Smith and here's a few of my tour tips. Um, I'd start by saying don't forget your cell phone charger. That's always something that I'm buying along the way. Uh, my band makes fun of me. Actually, last my last birthday they all went in on chargers and uh, got me like 10 different phone chargers for my birthday. Kept opening the same present over and over again. Yeah, I get it guys, it was funny. So, Anyhow, now I've got plenty of those. Make sure you do too. Uh, second tour tip is stay productive. I think that out here on the road you've got uh, a lot of time on your hands while you're waiting for the show and it's been a blessing to be with a crew that decides to take that time and use it for productivity. We write songs and um, and it's a really cool feeling because then you get to go on stage and and uh, try them out or you get to go on stage and, and then come back and listen to the fruit of your labor from earlier in the day. And so it's a, a continuous creative cycle that keeps you on your toes and I think that's good for you as an artist. The third tip, hire the right crew, you know, um, people that have your back, people that speak your language, know what your what your goals are and uh, can rally and support that and also just be in your corner. Everybody pulls for each other and that's how that's how teams win. Fourth tip, bring some things to do in your off time. Bring a fishing rod, bring your golf clubs, anything you like to do because sometimes you do need to just spend the morning getting out and uh, getting some fresh air. And so I keep my sticks under the bay, uh, which I can show you later. There's a lot of storage underneath this bus too. Keep all kinds of stuff down there. So bring bring what uh, what hobbies you have along the way too. Last one is just uh, stay grateful. Look around you. Know that what you're doing, a lot of people want to be doing. A lot of people would work uh, real hard to make it happen. So make sure you keep doing the same and uh, enjoy it as you do it. And uh, that's a lesson I've learned, so I feel like I can speak and say that, you know, if we open our eyes to the blessings around us, we'll be able to feel uh, a joy that can't go away. So let's do that on the road, too.